Hi, beautiful. How are you doing? You look fabulous. Thank you for joining me today on this wonderful, beautiful day. Look at you. Gorgeous. Whoa. Today, we're watching extremely viral hair-related TikToks. These videos have anywhere from like 25 million views to, hold on, 121 million views. Who is getting 121 million views on a video? I'm ready to see some crazy stuff happen. But first, I want to thank BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. If you know me, you know I love a good therapist. Especially in the past year, I cannot live without therapy, so there's no better feeling than talking to a stranger about all your problems and just unloading. BetterHelp is amazing because it assesses all of your needs and then matches you with a licensed professional therapist. It's also much more affordable than traditional online therapy and financial aid is available. So you can visit betterhelp.com slash bradmondo. That's better H-E-L-P. And you can join over 2 million people taking charge of their mental health with an experienced professional. And and I have obviously a special offer for you. Ooh, what is behind this black box? Let's turn it around. We have 10 views at all! <laughs> this will get you 10% off your first month at betterhelp.com slash Brad. Mondo. So start communicating within 48 hours. And by the way, it's not a crisis line. It's not self-help. It is professional therapy done securely online and is available worldwide. You can text your therapist whenever you want. You will get a timely and thoughtful response from them. And from there, you can schedule weekly video or phone sessions with your therapist. That way you never have to sit in an uncomfortable waiting room ever again. BetterHelp is committed to matching you with the right therapist so you can switch at any time free of charge. So thank you BetterHelp for sponsoring the video. Let's watch some viral TikToks. Okay, the first video we're going to watch has 97.7 million views. What could it be? Hold on. Okay. I can understand why this one has a lot of views. It was intriguing and I didn't exactly know what was going on until like the end. Let's break this down. So the first part, she is taking the extension hair or the hair from other people's heads that was cut off to make extensions and she's organizing it. That spiky thing that you see, that kind of like straightens out all the hair and makes sure it's going in all the same direction so that then they can sew the hair onto a beanie in this case or like tracks to make hair extensions, which I always love watching. Like, it is very interesting. If you've never seen how they make extensions before, I highly recommend looking it up because it is fascinating and so cool. So then she puts that sort of stocking cap on her head. I forget what they're called, like um, wig caps. That is what they're f***ing called, Brad. Then she takes out this extremely nice looking hat that she somehow just put together real quick. I don't know how it went from those bunch of strands to that hat in like one millisecond because that hat looks dope. And then she puts it on her head and she has this amazing looking wig hat. And I need one. I hope that they made a lot of sales from this video because that looks sick. The hair looks incredible. And if you ever just don't want to do your hair one day, I think this is a perfect alternative. That color looks perfect on her. She's so cute. I love her. Oh my God. That beanie. Oh my God. Should I buy one? No. Well, no, I don't need one. Do I? Uh, maybe. I feel like this is like 10 million views worthy. 97 million views worth. I don't know. I guess so. I mean, good for her. This next video has 29 million views. Much different than the last one, but still a lot. I've seen this one before. I've seen that before, but it's been a very long time and I forgot how gorgeous her hair is. It literally went from a perfect 70s, just gorgeousness, and then it went straight to 80s all of a sudden. I like the 80s look better, like, oh my God. Her haircut is perfect for this look. She has the most luscious, gorgeous hair, and oh my God, she was meant to have this hairstyle. She literally killed it. It is not that easy to make this look that good. I am impressed. Oh, and it's just so satisfying to watch her brush it out and see it all come alive. Like, oh, it never gets old. I could watch it again and again. That one definitely is worth 29 million. Yeah, that one does it for me. <laughs> this next video has 43 million views.
we hit the sweet spot with this one for me. This is the shit I like. This is the one that I would be double tapping on. This is the one I'd be like, Rrr. something about like just watching a toner be applied or like shampoo, like a little lather moment, a little bit of a spread of the hair thing, a little bit of shine, a lot of bit of shine actually it really gets me going. And then a lot of healthiness, healthy hair with a lot of shine. <laughs> that hair looks healthy as fuck and it looks good. Ah, uh, yes. That green color was incredible. I want that on my head right now. I'm going to have to make a wig for that because I just want to like wear it on the weekends and feel like my sassy self. I want to see more of that. I want to touch that hair. I want to like jump through the screen and be like, girl, that is mm, beautiful. Mwah. Love it. She called it green apple, the hair color, and I would have to agree that is quite a green apple color. This one has 49 million views. Oh my God, I can tell why this one is viral. That was insane. Not only did she like go the f through her hair with thinning shears, she also has an undercut on the entire underneath of her head. Like I already thought she had a lot of hair and you can also tell by the sound of those shears that there is so much hair on her head. Like when it sounds like that, when it's like crunching through, like they're biting through her hair, that's when you know somebody has a lot of hair and it's very, very, very coarse. Or the blades are just really uh, need to be sharpened on those shears. So maybe try that too. I'm sorry, but I do not feel bad for you. <laughs> I'll take some of your hair. Well, I'm sure there's plenty of people watching who will take your hair. I, for one, definitely will. I need a lot more. That is an interesting problem to have, but I don't think it's a bad one. <laughs> also a little scary and cringy to watch you just hack up like just different sections of your hair. I like get why you did it obviously, but I don't know. There was like no technique to it. It makes me nervous. I don't know. It's scary. Maybe try elevating the section before then going in with the thinning shears next time. That way you don't end up with like spots of like shortness and longness and it's more blended that way. That's my only suggestion. But I get why you need to do that because you have a whole lot of hair on that head and it is like, oh. This video has 72 million views. How do we unpack this? Whoa. <laughs> Okay, okay, oh, whoa, okay. Why was there a plunger on your head? What's the plunger for? I'm gonna say that's not a part of the cultural thing. I don't think. Uh, I think the rest is this kind of wrapped up situation at the, in the beginning. Very cool looking. This person has very, very healthy hair. What I found so interesting is like at first I was like, oh, okay, so he's balding on the top of his head. And then he went and shaved the top of his head. And then I realized that he has extremely thick hair and is not balding at all and that he actually just just shaves that entire area, which was just like wild. It sort of sounded like it hurt though. <laughs> like it was so intense. That ASMR in that video was top notch. I'm not even like a huge ASMR fan, but I can appreciate that. And also the little song he was making with the hair. It was an experience, man. Also, what a beautiful little spa treatment. We had the spritz on the hands. We had the ice cube. It was a whole experience he brought us along for, and I enjoyed every second of it. This next one has 41 million views. I've seen this type of thing many times. Usually they like wrap it around the brush, turn the brush over and then do the thing with the thing. I literally have tried it before. It takes a bit of skill to do that. I mean, I guess the way she's doing it, she's just wrapping around the brush. It's pretty easy and self-explanatory. Can I also just say that I have no idea why this one has so many views. I bet even this girl is like, what? Sometimes on TikTok, my videos that go viral, I'm like, that one went viral. The one I didn't do anything for and didn't try at all. Like this probably took her five seconds to film and she She's like literally just wrapping her hair around a brush. And I'm not saying anything is wrong with this video or this girl. I'm just saying it's surprising to me. I'm very happy for her. You know what? I could 
see why it's cool. She wraps around the brush and it makes a perfect, beautiful curl. I get that, but it seems pretty self-explanatory to me. But also a lot of things seem self-explanatory to me and they're actually not, so what do I know? This video has 70 million views. Um, I'm gonna say I don't get it. People really that enthused with this? Putting a stencil on the hair and a little hairspray? That's what gets people's attention? God, I need to try less. I need to do weirder shit on social media, clearly, because that, that, uh, did people not know that you can make a design with a stencil on hair? I mean, go off. I guess it was a cool stencil. I'll say that it was a nice looking stencil with a lot of detail and it looks like kind of like a snakeskin sort of pattern went on the hair, so it was kind of cool. I'm gonna move on now because I don't know what else to say about that. Okay, get ready for how many views this has. This has a hundred and 21 million views, largest amount of views we're gonna see today. That is just an insane amount of people um, watching. So let's see what it is. <laughs> gets me every time. Like, I'm over here thinking like, this is gonna be the coolest thing ever. This is gonna look dope. Like, I don't know, this guy clearly knows what he's doing with the butcher knife and like, I just feel like it's gonna come out cool. Like, if they're gonna show this, they're gonna, it's gonna come out cool. Oh no. She lifts that head up and we just see a total disaster on the back of their head. Like, it looks so jagged, so f up. Let's not cut the hair with a butcher knife next time. That would be a good idea, but very entertaining and I get why this one has so many views. I wouldn't recommend it though. Don't cut your hair on a cutting board with a butcher knife or do. I would love to see it. <laughs> this one has 98 million views. That's the video. It was very nicely done. Very beautiful. The pearls were a nice little touch, I must say. But you could have done a little more. I thought she was gonna start wrapping the hair up, adding like extensions and shit. Like, no, we just ended with a few bubbles and a bow and some pearls. I was like, give me more. Cause I don't want it to stop there. But we did. This next video has 20 million views. Now that is a good ass wig. She made that look so simple and just easy to do, but it is not at all. Also that color, mwah, 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 most beautiful color ever on her. She looks like a completely different person from the start to the finish of this video. Wow, that wig was like the most beautiful thing ever. And then she finished it off with that satisfying moment with the straightener. Oh, it could have not gotten better, but it did because when she took that band off her head and that lace was melted in there, That got me like, oh, oh, you know what I mean? Like it was like a but sort of moment. Like I loved that. Oh, you were so talented. Yes, please teach me your ways. Me putting on wigs, it's like a whole f mess all the time. I could probably get better at it, but I'd rather just watch people like you do it really well. Those TikToks were literally like, I, some of them I really didn't understand how they got so many views. Some of them were actually super satisfying and incredible, but wow, that's a lot of views. Make sure you guys check out my hair care brand and my hair color brand. They're linked below or go to xmondohair.com to get fabulous, sexy, beautiful, healthy hair. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to live your extra life and I'll see you next time. Bye.